And it's time now to take a look at what's been happening in the world of sports. Joining us in the studio is our sports editor, Paul Need. Evening, Paul. Evening. Let's first start with archery. A recurve team clean sweep, sweep for Korea in Paris. Yes, that's right. And uh, bouncing back from the shock early exit in Berlin earlier this month. Uh, at the Hyundai Archery World Cup Stage 4 in Paris on Sunday, Korea's team of Ansan, Kang Cheyong, and Im Shi Hyun beat Chinese Taipei 6 2 to earn gold. The loss to Indonesia in Berlin earlier in the month was Korea's worst ever result in the World Championships. Korea, though, went on to seal a clean sweep in the recurve team events, with the men also beating Chinese Taipei in the gold medal match. And moving on to the Women's World Cup, um, Spain are the champions? Yes, that's right. They beat England 1-0 in the final on Sunday in Sydney. Uh, Captain Olga Carmona scored the game's only goal with 29 minutes on the clock. It's Spain's first Women's World Cup win and only the third time they've qualified for the tournament. Spain's previous best was the round of 16 in 2019 in France. For England, who won the Euros last year, the loss was just their second in two years under their manager, Serena Wegman. England goalkeeper Mary Earps, meanwhile, won the Golden Glove. And Japan's Miyaza Hinata won the Golden Boots with five goals and one assist. And seeing with football, a first win for captain Sonny. Yes, that's right. Yeah, Tottenham on Saturday picked up their first win of the season, beating Manchester United at home 2 0. It was something of a game of firsts. It was uh, the first, of course, for Son Min as new captain and the first for new boss Ange Postacoglu. It was also Tottenham's first home win of Manchester United since moving to their new stadium in 2019. Meanwhile, over in Germany, Kim Min Jae made his Bundesliga debut, helping Bayern Munich earn a 4 0 win over Werder Bremen in what was the team's first league match of the season. Kim moved to Bayern from Napoli in Italy this summer for a fee believed to be around 50 million euros. Harry Kane also made his Bundesliga bow in that game and scored the match's second goal, having recently moved to Munich from Tottenham. And to baseball now, um, a win, another win for Lee Hyunjin. Tell us more. Yes, his second of the season and second in as many starts as well. On Sunday, away to the Cincinnati Reds, who you helped the Toronto Blue Jays pick up a 10-3 win. He allowed just four singles and two runs, both unearned over the five innings he was on the mound for. Liu is now 2-1 with an ERA of 1.89 for starts since returning from elbow surgery. He has also extended his run of not giving up an earned run to 14 innings. He threw 83 pitches and 56 of them were strikes. He struck out seven and walked just one. And moving on to, on to golf now, three Korean stars are through to the final PGA Tour playoff. Yes, that's right. And that is actually a record, the number three. Mm. Im Sung Jae, uh, Kim Ju Hyung, or Tom Kim, as he's known on the PGA Tour, and Kim Shi Yu are all through. This is the most at a single tour championship since the playoff system was brought in in 2007. Only the top 30 in the FedEx rankings make it through. And Im Sung Jae finished seventh in the BMW Championship on Sunday after hitting a 10 under 270. Kim Ji Hong finished tied for 10th with 7 under 273, while Kim Shi Yu finished tied for 31st with an even par 280. For Im Sung Jae, it'll be his fifth straight appearance at the Tour Championship. Last year, he finished second, just one stroke behind the winner, Roy McElroy. The final PGA Tour a playoff event tees off in Atlanta, the U.S., later this week. And to finally to athletics, um, another World Athletics Championships. Final for high jumper Wu sang -hyo. Yes, you're quite right. It's his second in a row as well, in fact. And uh, yes, Wu on Sunday in Hungary sealed a place in the final of the World Athletics Championships. Athletes had to clear a height of 2.3 meters or be in the top 12. Wu cleared 2.28 to finish fourth out of 36. He is now looking to make history as a medal would make him the first South Korean to do so at back-to-back -back World Championships. He won silver last year. The final will take place at 7.58 p.m. Tuesday in Hungary or 2.58 a.m. Wednesday, South Korea time. All righty. Thanks for that, Paul. See you next week. Thank you.